Hey guys, welcome back to another studio vlog. Hope you guys are all doing well. If you're new to my channel, then welcome. My name is Julie and this channel is based on me trying to build my J True Design business. I have a shop on Etsy and I make party decorations and gifts for people. So hopefully you find my videos interesting to you or possibly relaxing. And occasionally I will make DIY videos on how to make party decorations as well. So feel free to check all those videos out. So as usual, I will take you through my working day and show you the type of orders I receive and how I package them and get them sent out. So hopefully you enjoy it. See you in a moment. So I have just pre-cut some of these cupcake toppers. This one says, oh boy, lovely number two in baby blue. And these little cute crowns. And also I need to pack some of these 50th drawers as well. Yeah, so it should be fun getting through, adding these sticks to these cake toppers. If you guys are enjoying this video so far then I would really appreciate it if you can hit the like button down below this will help my channel reach out to more people and it's good for the YouTube algorithm as well thank you all so much So I asked a question in my previous studio vlog um, if you guys would like to see some of the old cake toppers I made and um, I thought I'll start off and show you some of the baby shower ones first. So you've got baby here. You've got oh baby and oh girl. 
and then I've got happy three months. Some people like to celebrate their baby's birthday like on a monthly basis, which is quite cute. Got happy five months here. Happy four months. Got happy two months. And then now moving on to uh, birthdays. Got one birthday here. Ten years. I mean, this could also be for anniversary or wedding. Got a fifty cake topper here. And this one right here. I quite like this one actually, but um doesn't seem to be that popular for some reason. But oh well. I've got the unicorn here, which obviously can be personalised with any age. And this one is a name that customers can personalise. And then moving on to <coughs> graduation. This is a very old design. Yeah, I made this quite some time ago. Didn't do too well, but I'll keep these cake toppers, you know, just for, I suppose, reference or just memory. See, see what I've achieved. Congrats. And then Mother's Day, got best mum forever. Hope you guys can see it. Maybe you can see it with my t-shirt at the back. <laughs> and this one I made this year actually. I don't know if you guys remember if you had watched one of my studio vlogs, I made this. And for A religious celebration and I recently made one for my best friend's daughter's birthday she is turning three so my friend wanted to do a princess unicorn theme for her and this is what I came up with this is not actually listed on my shop I don't know if I should or not because um, yeah I mean I do really like it actually. What do you guys think? Can you see it? I added crystals on top as well just for that extra special touch. But yeah, hopefully her daughter Isla will like it. Let me know what you guys think of this one and all the other cake toppers that I've just shown you. And um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that little bit. So. I'll see you in the next part. So I'm just about to cut this um, cake topper out and if you had watched my last video I mentioned that my Cricut Design space on my laptop is not working so I am relying on my phone to cut all my um, decorations out. It is a slightly longer process than usual but I'm getting the hang of it so hopefully I'll get to fix my um, my Cricut design on my laptop soon, so yeah, let's go!
So today I wanted to design a new flyer for my business with all my details on it. Um, this one I've had for quite some time only because I've ordered way too many of them, like about a thousand. So I've only got this much left, which is good. And um, yeah, I think it's good to order less. Maybe next time I'll order 500 and once that's almost finished, I'll change up the design a bit. So yeah, you'll get to see me design my next flyer then. So this time I wanted the flyer to be a square shape and I wanted to have a back cover as well as a front cover. So um, yep, just in the process of designing it right now. So this is the front and the back. So now I'm going to get it printed and hopefully I can get to show you in the next studio vlog. So that is it for today guys. I hope you have enjoyed watching all those footages that I've put together for you. And if you have any questions, please do leave it in the comments down below. I would love to respond to them. And thank you all so much for supporting my channel. It means a lot to me. And I just wanted to point out that I haven't really uploaded any Etsy listings this week, so it remains on 290, but that's okay because I know it will go up again at some point. And also, in my spare time, I've been trying to complete my Christmas felt decorations, which I sew on a yearly basis. Um, they, are, they do take up a lot of my time and I think this could be the final year that I make them and sell them because um, I've got other plans for next year. Hopefully they go ahead, but I won't tell you what they are yet. Yeah, but if you guys are interested in buying one of my felt decorations, feel free to check it in my shop link down in the description box below. And I just wanted to say a big thank you to you guys for making my channel reach 4,000 subscribers. You guys are amazing. Thank you for um, spending the time to watch my videos and liking them and commenting on them. It does bring uh, lots of engagement to my channel and get more exposure. So please continue to like this video. And if you're new, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.